here's the cutter. I hold it like this with my thumb here and my pointer finger there. And then I don't try and cut anything right away. I get a feel for how much pressure to use. And uh, people think that when you're cutting glass, you're cutting glass, but you're not. You're breaking glass along the line of least resistance. And you'd want to just make quite a few cuts until you get a feel for it. And then what you want to do is um, practice on following a straight line. Um, when you're cutting glass into a frame, you don't want a whole bunch of glass hanging over one end because the weight of the glass will start to break it. This is kind of borderline, but just to show you, I normally take a little bit of that glass off so there isn't a lot of weight, but this one probably wouldn't have been enough weight to make it break. And then I just start down here cut it right into the frame and it's mainly locking my shoulder and elbow and kind of just walking along with it and it just takes some practice there we go and some people get nervous about glass because it is sharp but what you don't want to do is rub your fingers like that on the edge or you will get cut. But most people can grab a hunk of glass and not get cut unless they slide their fingers up and down on it. And I know it looks harder than it is, but um, that's how I cut glass into a frame.